we are in Hyde Park and in this video I want to show you how dry of a summer it's been look how dry it is uh, maybe the sun's in the picture but if you were to just check this out the grass is wild, it's grown wild and then even the leaves on the trees have dried up There's the high pop waters in the background and then look at the leaves here. A lot of the leaves have fallen on some trees and just the majority of them are very dry. It's only August so the leaves shouldn't have fallen this early. But It's been a long dry summer hitting 40 degrees certain days 38, 35, 33 were very normal and this is West Coast It has rained for the past two days um, which has sort of helped and a bit of the greenery has come back but overall if you were to summarise the summer in one picture that would be here, that would be this Look, people mock, we like to joke, and everyone knows that London is just wet, always wet, and there's just a lot of rain, it's cold, it's a bit gloomy at most, of the, most of the month, but we've had a very long sunny dry summer. to the point where a lot of the trees uh, look like autumn trees but it's only August Wow look at this Try not to get families in there. I uh, really want to capture this. It's very dry. You can hear the sound of the leaves that I'm walking in. And uh, you can probably tell. It's probably leaves on top of leaves. To be honest, there's some trees that are just very lush green. But even those, upon close inspection, uh, have had a lot of leaves dried up. Look at this tree. There's chopped it up and just left the main trunk there. It looks nice actually. It's a bit odd but nice. This is a tree so from far it looks green and then when you get close it's also got many dry leaves. Beautiful beautiful breeze. capture this in a second. Let's capture these angles. It looks really nice. So this must have been a long time ago in memory of Speaky, Speaky, Victoria Nyanzi, Nyanza sorry, and the Nile. I think the Nile is referring to the river Nile but I don't want to sound silly if I'm wrong that angle is not as good but let's just catch the sign Diana, Princess of Wales, so the Di Princess Diana Memorial 
some Italian fountains, toilets. The fountain again, there's a memorial, Diana's memorial playground and then there's a fountain. Let's carry on walking. So, Hyde Park is so big, if I was to actually walk around the parameters outside, lanes, all, and intersect, or just cover as much ground as possible, it would probably take two hours. So we try to get it to you in snippets. Look at that. This is pretty bad to be honest. I've never seen London have such dry trees in August. I mean, I have seen the fields dry, but this is another level. I mean, look at this. This is no longer a tree. At this point, it's just box and a trunk. <laughs> and then there's a row of them. They look like a shade between green and brown. Someone wants to look at this, just those five trees in the middle, and to take a picture, they would think that it's autumn because of the lack of sun. Uh, however, it's the opposite, we've had too much sun. The ground's rock hard as well because of the dryness. We are approaching some sort of memorial. I think it's the Princess Diana one. That would be nice to, to get in as well. In the police van. <laughs> Strolling through. We might end it with the memorial. Princess Diana. Uh, you know, oh, what can I say? I think you could say she could have survived if things were better handled. There's a lot of people chilling around here. Picnics. Falcons. So this is the fountains. <laughs> The video might end soon because the battery is low, but I really want to get this in. Italian garden sells on. This is Italian gardens. I get why they called it that. <laughs> 